so much to learn about. It'll make you want to shout, Blippi! <laughs> hey! It's me, Blippi! I just finished writing a lot of invitations for a party next week. <laughs> I'm so excited. And I'm excited because I'm going to make a really yummy dinner. <laughs> Can you guess what I'm going to make for dinner? I'll give you a hint. Hmm. It has a lot of toppings and can be made really big so a lot of people can share it. Hmm. <laughs> yeah, that's right. I'm going to have a pizza party. <laughs> and I know the perfect place that we can learn how to make pizza. Oleo pizza. <laughs> Come on. This is going to be so much fun. I'll see you there. It's me, Plippy, and today we're here in our real-life pizza kitchen. Yeah! So we're gonna learn how to make pizza. Oh, I'm so excited. But first things first, we gotta put on our gloves. So here we go. One. And we'll put on another one. <laughs> here we go. Great. We got our gloves on and we're all ready to make some pizza. Hey, uh, what's your name? Hey, my name is Michael. Uh, hi, Michael. Uh, can you teach us how to make some pizza today? Yes, no problem. I want to teach how to make the pizza. Oh, okay. Okay, the first thing, you need to take the spatula. Okay. Flour. Okay. And this is the dough, okay? Oh, yeah. Okay, you need to put the, a little bit of flour in the top. You take it out the dough, and you put again in the flour, okay? Okay. After that, you need to split a little bit of flour in the, in the flour. You push a little bit, you take it out the, the air. Whoa, After okay. that, you need to shape a little bit. Push it. Nice. <laughs> and you start Whoa. shaping. Ooh, it's so stretchy and stringy. <laughs> yeah. Shape it, shape it, shape it. Whoa. And when it's almost done, you need to put it again right here. Whoa. You're really good at making pizza, Michael. Yeah. After that, <laughs> you need to put tomato sauce. Oh, oh. Here's the sauce. Whoa, look at that. Put a spoon. <laughs> you just put the shaver right here. Okay. <laughs> Whoa. After that, you need to put the cheese. Okay, cheese. This is a Parmesan cheese. Parmesan cheese. It's so good, yes. And this is a mozzarella cheese. Mmm, yummy. Oh. So and then. Fresh basil. Oh, fresh basil. <gasps> Ooh, so yummy! Nice. And the small oh. pieces. <laughs> Make it nicely. Ooh. And a uh, cherry heirloom tomatoes. Ooh, tomatoes! Mm. After that, you need to put like olive oil. Okay. <gasps> and that's the pizza ready for the oven. Oh, yeah! That pizza looks so yummy. <gasps> this pizza goes to the oven, okay? Yeah. <laughs> now, you wanna make pizza? yeah, can I make okay, a pizza no too? Okay. Here Here's we go. The flour. Take the flour. Put the flour on the top. Whoa. Take it out. <laughs> take so, it. Yeah. Here we go. Nice. We put in the flour. We'll put it in the yeah. flour. Play with the dough. <laughs> kind of sticky. Here we go. And we're gonna take it out again. Take it out. We should take it out the, the air. Yeah. Okay. We'll push all the air out and the bubbles out of the pizza dough. Whoa! Whoa! It's so stringy. Whoa! <laughs> so silly. Okay. Here we go. Keep pushing out all those bubbles. Mm -hmm. Okay. Here we go. Keep doing it. Keep pushing it out. A little bit, yeah. You can flip a little bit. Yeah. Nice. Here we go. Whoa! It's starting to look just like a pizza. Whoa! This is a lot harder than it looks. <laughs> Here we go. Nice. Whoa! A little bit more. <laughs> You're really good at this. <laughs> Whoa! You can put tomato sauce inside. Yeah. You can put tomato. Look at this. This is really yummy tomato sauce. Whoa! <laughs> okay, now let's put the tomato sauce on the pizza. Here we go. Whoop. And then we're gonna mix it around. Okay. Parmesan cheese. Nice. And now we have our Parmesan cheese. So yummy. Ooh. Put a little on there. And the mozzarella cheese. And we got some mozzarella. 
cool. Whoa, this cheese is really cool because it's in all kinds of shapes. Do you know what kind of shape this mozzarella cheese is? <laughs> yeah, that's right. It's a triangle. Okay, so I'll put some of those little triangles and squares. Hmm, put some more squares. More squares. Whoa, right, after okay. After that, you need to put the basil a little bit. Some, some basil. Fresh basil. Fresh basil, yummy. Whoa. <laughs> Whoa, that's a lot of basil. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> olive oil on the top. And a little bit of olive oil, here we go. Whoa. <laughs> so silly. And that's the margarita bean, so you can put the tomatoes too. Okay, we'll put a couple tomatoes that have been chopped in half that are also really yummy. We'll put those on top. <gasps> and now the pizza is almost ready to go in the oven. <laughs> awesome. Well, really Michael, easy. thank you so much for Michael. teaching me how to make a pizza. <laughs> yeah, and thank you for helping me make some yummy, yummy pizza. <laughs> Good job. Now, let's go put these pizzas into the oven. <laughs> Here we go. Whoa. <laughs> you, need to, you move a little bit, because you sure you're not stuck in the field. Uh, you put in the oven. Whoa. It's really hot in this oven. Whoa. I can't wait for it to be all done. <laughs> Let's go put the other pizza Let in. Let me put the other one. Yeah. It's the same thing. <laughs> this. <laughs> Make sure the toppings is good. Whoa. Whoa. Look at it. Right. There's a big fire inside this pizza oven. It's really, really hot. And, and it you helps wait to like cook the pizza. Seconds. You wait like 30 seconds after that, you can flip the pizza, okay? <laughs> Ooh. Well, now all we have to do is wait for the pizza to get done. <laughs> so I'm gonna do a pizza dance. Here we go. <laughs> so silly. <laughs> okay, it looks like the pizza is almost ready. Let's see. Whoa, the pizza almost done, almost done. is almost done. The pizza was really small, but because the dough has flour and yeast, when it gets really hot, the dough begins to rise and it becomes a delicious pizza. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Whoa, that was so much fun, learning how to make pizza at Olio Pizza. It was so delicious. Hey. Did you know that pizza originally came from Italy? <laughs> yeah, and it makes me really want to learn how to speak Italian. So I invited my good friend Francesca over. <laughs> I think that's her. Hello? Hi, Puppy. Hi, Francesca. <laughs> I'm so excited to learn Italian. We just learned how to make pizza. Do you think you could teach us some Italian? Si, certo. Whoa, <laughs> that was Italian. <laughs> and I said, of course. Ooh, I'm so excited to learn. Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> this is gonna be so much fun. So first, maybe we should learn our numbers. Okay, let's count to five together. Okay, here we go. Zero. 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 zero <laughs> uno. Uno. One. Due. Due. Two. Ooh. <laughs> tre. Tre. Three. Quattro. Quattro. Ooh. <laughs> which is four. Cinque. Cinque. Whoa. Five. Whoa. We did it. We counted to five. <laughs> okay. So we learned how to count in five to five in Italian. Maybe we can learn how to say our colors. <laughs> Rosso. Rosso. Red. Verde. Verde. Green. Ooh. <laughs> Giallo. Giallo. Yellow. Yellow. <laughs> and your two favorite colors. Orange and blue. Yes. Arancione. Arancione. Orange. Orange. <laughs> and blue. 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 <laughs> Whoa. That was so awesome. But I still feel a little bit hungry. Hmm. Maybe Francesca can teach us some food. Okay, 
So, cibo. Cibo. Food. Ooh. <laughs> Aqua. Aqua. Water. Water. <laughs> Pane. Pane. Bread. <laughs> Torta. Torta. Cake. Cake. I love cake, especially birthday cake. Do you like cake too? <laughs> awesome. <laughs> Pizza. 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 <laughs> well, that one was pretty easy. Well, thanks so much for teaching us Italian, Francesca. You're welcome, Blippi. Hey, will you dance the pizza dance with us? Of course. <laughs> yeah, and you can dance along too. Let's go. <laughs> I'm so excited to do the pizza dance with you. Okay, stand up and dance along with us. <laughs> yeah. Step into my kitchen for a very tasty treat. With saucy sauce and cheesy cheese, these flavors can't be beat. Your mouth will start to water when you see what we can make. A little piece of Italy, the most delicious bake. Grab some dough, roll that dough, and toss it in the air. Then take a scoop of saucy sauce and spread it everywhere. Don't forget your toppings, extra cheese, sure sounds nice. Open wide and take a bite of a warm, delicious slice. That was awesome! Woo! Great job! It was so much fun, Blippi. Thank you for having me here. Oh, it was so nice to have you. And thank you for dancing along and learning with us. Bye, Francesca. Bye, everyone. Bye, Blippi. Oh, that was so awesome! <laughs> we learned about so much today. How to make pizza, how to speak Italian. <laughs> it was great! Well, that's the end of this video. But if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. <laughs> hey, can you spell my name with me? Okay, let's spell it together. B-L-I-P-P-I. -I. Blippi. Good job. Well, I'll see you soon. Bye-bye. Hey, it's me, Blippi. Whoa, and I'm drinking some really tasty orange juice. Mmm, <laughs> it's so tasty, and it's sweet, and it's my favorite color, <laughs> the color orange. <laughs> hey, I wonder where orange juice comes from. Yeah, oh, <laughs> that's right, it comes from oranges. <laughs> Silly me. <laughs> oranges are so tasty and really good for your body, because they give you lots of vitamins and energy. <laughs> yeah! There are so many cool, colorful fruits. <laughs> Whoa, there's so many different shapes and sizes. <laughs> Whoa, look at this. Whoa, <laughs> look at these fruits. These are really fuzzy. Ooh. <laughs> They're soft. Whoa, yeah. These fruits are kiwi. Whoa, they're the color brown. Hmm. But kiwi, if you cut them open, they're the color green. And they're really sweet inside. Whoa, blue! <laughs> they're really cool. I'm gonna save these for later. Whoa. Mm. Whoa. <laughs> Look at this fruit. <laughs> this fruit is really big uh, and heavy. <laughs> this is a watermelon. Whoa, and the watermelons are really big and tasty. <laughs> yeah, they're the color green, but kind of like a kiwi. If you open them up, they're red inside. And they have lots of little teeny tiny black seeds that'll grow up to be other watermelons. <laughs> Whoa! That was so cool! We learned about all these different colors and, and fruits. <laughs> and we learned about orange juice comes from oranges. Whoa! <laughs> hey, but now that we know where orange juice comes from, where do oranges come from? Hmm, maybe they grow up really tall in a tree. Or maybe they're down in the ground? Hmm, I'm not sure. But I know a great place that you and I can go. We can find out all we need to know about oranges. <laughs> hey, will you go with me? <laughs> yeah, come on, let's go. I'm so excited.
<laughs> hey, it's me, Flippy, and today we're here at Showcase of Citrus in Claremont, Florida. <laughs> yeah, and today we get to learn all about oranges. Growing oranges, picking oranges, juicing oranges. <laughs> yeah, I'm super excited and hungry because oranges are really tasty. Not only that, but it's my favorite color. <laughs> this is going to be so much fun. Come on. <laughs> hey, I'm so excited to learn all about oranges. But first, you and I get to go on a really exciting adventure ride on these big monster trucks. <laughs> yeah. Hey, let's get a closer look. Come on. Whoa, look at it. These wheels and tires are massive. They're even taller than me. <laughs> Whoa, I just love monster trucks. Whoa, and look inside this wheel. It's really big. It echoes. Echo. <laughs> Hello. Whoa, I am so excited to get in one of the monster trucks. And hey, look, it's the driver. Uh, hello, what's your name? Hi, my name's Amy. Hi, Amy. <gasps> I think Amy's gonna take us on a monster truck ride. This is gonna be great. Come on. And hey, look, it's Amy. Hi, Amy. Hi, come on on. Let's go. We're riding on a real life monster truck. <laughs> yeah. Let's sit down and get ready to start. All right, let's go. Okay, we're gonna go. <laughs> yeah. That's a really loud engine. <laughs> this is gonna be awesome. So Amy, I really like oranges. Will we be able to pick some oranges to eat later? We will. Ooh. <laughs> Can we just pick any oranges we want? So we only have a certain amount of oranges that are available to pick. Some of them aren't ready yet, Ooh. but we do have lots of them. Well, how do you tell if an orange is ready or not? So how you tell is usually by the color. Um, sometimes, though, it's usually more of when you feel it. Make mm. sure at least it's a little bit soft. Ooh, we like oranges that are nice and soft and juicy. We don't want an unripe orange. <laughs> no. Are those normally green oranges? They actually are. A lot of people don't know that. Um, so actually, you know, during um, fall, how the leaves mm -hmm. start to change? Mm -hmm. That's the same thing with oranges. They start off green, and once it gets cool, um, they start to turn that nice yellow orange color. Um, and that is when you know they're ready to pick. Whoa, that's so cool. I didn't know that before. But you have leaves in fall that are green, and then they turn my favorite color orange. <laughs> yeah. And Amy's telling me that it's the same thing with oranges. They're green and not very good to eat. And then they get nice and sweet and tasty as orange oranges. <laughs> My favorite. <laughs> hey, that was so much fun riding the monster truck with you. Well, I'm really excited because Amy's going to help us pick some oranges in the orange grove. Yeah, come on. Let's go pick some tasty oranges. <laughs> All right, so to start, you're going to need your bag. Oh, we got our bag. You're also gonna need your picker. This is to help to get the oranges that are way high on top of the tree. Okay, and next we'll use the picker. Okay, so we need to pick some oranges, but do you remember what color we needed to pick the orange at? Hmm, <laughs> yeah, that's right, yellowish orange. See this one right here? Yeah, this orange is the color green. And it's a little firm, so it's not quite ripe yet. We wanna find one, hmm. I don't see any on this tree. Mm -hmm. Let's keep looking for an orange that's the right color. Come on. Ooh, there are so many oranges on this one. <laughs> hey, Amy, let's pick this one right here. So how do I pick this orange? All right, so we're gonna do is you're gonna pull and okay. twist. So I'll sit that yep. down. We're gonna pull and twist. There you go. Twist and pull. Oh. Whoa. <laughs> you got two. I picked two oranges, yeah. And look, they're a nice yellowish orange color, which means they're gonna be super sweet and tasty. Yeah. Okay, so I'll put these in our orange bag. Mm -hmm. and pick some more oranges. All right, gotcha. Okay, let's get this one up All here. Right. We're gonna use the picker because it's too high up for me to get. We'll grab it with the picker and then gonna twist it. Whoa! <laughs> hey! And we got it! And then you just reach into the picker and you got yourself a tasty orange. Hmm. 
Hi, Sammy. Welcome. Hey, and look, this orange tree has some really pretty white flowers. Huh. What are these white flowers called? Those are orange blossoms. Huh. Well, they sure are really pretty. What are these uh, flowers for? Just pretty decoration? No, so actually these are going to end up turning into this. What? No way! Yeah. Did you hear that? Those pretty orange blossoms are going to grow up big and strong and be a tasty fruit. <laughs> yeah. I can't wait to eat some for myself. Hey, how about let's pick some more and then we can taste them. <laughs> yeah. Okay, let's keep picking some oranges. Pick them down. Whoa, here's another one. Mm -hmm. One. Pick a second one. Two. Let's get another. Three. We can fit one more in there. Oh, we can fit one more. It's looking pretty full. Here we go. And four. <laughs> yeah. Four oranges. And whoa, it looks like I filled up the entire bag with oranges. Yeah. These are going to be really tasty in juice or just by themselves. <laughs> well, thanks so much, Amy. You're welcome. Let's go eat them. Come on. <laughs> so much fun picking all of those tasty oranges from the orange grove. And now we get to enjoy them by making some tasty orange juice. Yeah, we have everything we need right here. We have some cups. Ooh. <laughs> we have our oranges. That'll have all the juice. We have our juicer. <laughs> yeah, and this juicer will put the oranges in here and that'll squeeze out all the juice into our cup. And last but not least, we have our cutting board and we have a knife. Now, the first thing we need to do is take our orange and cut it in half. But just remember to never use a knife without a parent's help. Okay, here we go. Whoa, look at it. It's so colorful inside. <laughs> woo, woo. <laughs> so silly. Yeah, look at the inside. There's all these little parts that hold in all that sweet orange juice. Yeah, and look at the outside of it. All that little parts that are all white, that's called the pith. Yeah, the pith is a really healthy part of the orange. So if you're ever eating an orange, make sure you eat that part too, because it has lots of healthy vitamins. Cool, okay, so we have our oranges cut in half, and now take the juicer and a cup, put the orange in the juicer and we're gonna squeeze really hard and we'll watch as all the juice comes out of the bottom. Are you ready? Here we go. One, two, three. <laughs> Whoa, look at it. Whoa, woo. <laughs> yeah, and then you just take the orange out, put them right there, put in the other half. <laughs> Look at all that orange juice. Whoa, it's really good that we have this juicer to help us get all the juice out. Otherwise, it would be really tricky juicing these oranges. Also, if you look at the bottom, the orange juicer has all these teeny little slits. Yeah, and those slits help to catch all of the seeds inside of the orange. Yeah, each orange, whoo, these are kind of hard to pick up, has these teeny tiny little seeds and the seeds are gonna one day grow up and be really strong, big trees. First, the seed, you plant it in the soil and a little leaf sprouts up. And then after you water it and take care of it for a little bit, it'll become a seedling, which is kind of like a teeny tiny little baby tree. And then it grows into a small tree and then into a really big adult tree. And it will grow fresh oranges to pick off the tree. <laughs> Well, we already picked our oranges, so I'm gonna get to cutting and juicing so we can taste some yummy orange juice. Let's go! <laughs> Whoa, look at this one. This orange is red inside. Whoa, <laughs> that's really silly. Yeah, that's because this orange is called a red navel. 
<laughs> it's colored red, but it'll still be really tasty. So we'll choose some of these too. was a lot of oranges to make this yummy cup of orange juice, <laughs> but I think it's all gonna be worth it. And now we get to taste the fruits of our labor. <laughs> okay, here we go. <gasps> oh, yeah! <laughs> this is really tasty. It's super sweet and really healthy too. Did you know that orange juice has lots of vitamin C in it? And it's really good for immunity to help you fight disease and stay nice and strong and healthy. <laughs> yeah, I think I'm gonna have another sip. <laughs> so tasty. Well, thanks so much for helping me learn how to make some orange juice. <laughs> yeah. Hey. <laughs> Whoa, that was so much fun picking oranges with our good friend Amy at Showcase of Citrus. <laughs> They were so tasty! <laughs> yeah! Ooh, look at this! <laughs> it looks like it's time for the Bubbles Lab! Yeah! And look at what it says! Sink or float! <laughs> yeah! I love that game! Sink or float! And I have a really good idea. How about we see if the fruit that we learned about and these oranges will sink or float in some water. Oh, this is gonna be so much fun. <laughs> yeah. Hello. <laughs> Whoa, look at all this stuff. I am so excited for sink or float. Whoa. And it looks like we get to do a science experiment. Yeah, a science experiment. <laughs> do you know what that is? That's when you make a guess about something, like if it will sink or float, and then you try it out to see if your guess was right. <laughs> Let's go see if some fruit sink or float. Let's go. <laughs> Whoa, look, it's all the delicious and colorful fruit from earlier. We have all kinds. Hey, let's start with the strawberries and see if they sink or float. Ooh. <laughs> okay, here we go. What do you think? Will they sink or float? Whoa, look at it. <laughs> they float to the top. Whoa, those strawberries are having a fun time floating. Woo, <laughs> let's try another fruit. Hmm, whoa, what about this fruit? This is an avocado. Let's see if it sinks or floats. <laughs> okay, here we go. On the count of three, we're gonna drop it in. Hmm, I wonder what it does. Three, two, one. Whoa, Whoa what's it gonna do? Oh, look at it. It sinks right to the bottom. <laughs> that was really cool. Okay, it's time to try one more fruit. Hey, what about an orange? Let's try the orange. Woo, <laughs> this is gonna be fun. Okay. Here we go. Whoa! Whoa! Ooh, <laughs> that was bouncy. Now look, the orange floats to the top. Wait a minute. Oranges have peels. What if we peel it and try it again? Okay, let's try it. There's a little one, and it doesn't have its peel. It looks kind of silly. Ooh, <laughs> let's see if it sinks or floats. Whoa! <laughs> Did you see it? Yeah. We know something sinks or floats because of density. If an orange with a peel is kind of loosely packed together, then it's gonna float. But like the peeled orange, if it's really tightly packed together, oh, <laughs> then it'll sink to the bottom. Wow, that was so much fun doing a science experiment with you of sink or float. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa! All that sweet, sweet orange juice has me in the mood for some sweet, sweet dance moves. <laughs> yeah! Let's do the OJ twist together. 
And here are the moves. Do you remember how we picked oranges with Amy? Yeah. You grab the orange, and then you twist. And you pull it up. And then you have an orange. So that's what we're going to do. Grab an orange, grab an orange, and twist. <laughs> the second step is to have lots of fun and jump around while you're doing it. <laughs> I'm so excited to dance with you. Let's go. <laughs> now take your hands and move your fist. You're doing it. The OJ twist. Do the OJ twist. Twist, twist, and twist like this. This, this, it'll be real sweet. with you at the Orange Groves. Oh, <laughs> we got to do so many awesome things, like eat oranges and pick oranges and drink some tasty orange juice. <laughs> yeah! Oh, and we even got to do a really cool bubbles lab where we learned if oranges sink or float. <laughs> and a lot of other things. <laughs> well, this is the end of this video. But if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Hey, can you spell my name with me? <laughs> yeah! E-L-I-P-P-I. -P -I. Flippy. Good job. Well, I'll see you soon. <laughs>
how about I hit this triangle, this little stick, and see what sound it makes. What do you think? Should I play the triangle? <laughs> okay, here we go. On the count of three. One, two, three, triangle! <laughs> Did you hear that sound? Let's play it again. If you close your eyes, it kinda sounds like a little fairy. Or maybe the bell telling you that dinner's ready. <laughs> Ooh, I'm getting hungry. <laughs> this triangle is really cool because it makes a really pretty ding sound. But depending on how you hold it or hit this triangle, it can make different sounds like this. Ooh, that's different. <laughs> Maybe not as pretty, but definitely cool. It would make some really interesting music. You can also hit it soft for a little ding, <laughs> or really big and loud for a big ding. Here we go. Whoa, triangles are so cool. Hey, and look at this over here. What's this? Hmm, well, this doesn't look like a musical instrument because it's not a musical instrument. This is a metronome. Yeah, this is really helpful if you're trying to keep the beat and stay on time. Mm -hmm. Yeah, see this right here? This metronome is gonna move and tell us how fast the beat of the song is. Okay, here we go. And with this metronome, you'll see something really cool. Do you hear the dings? <laughs> Whoa, see, it moves back and forth and tells you the beat of the song. <laughs> Whoa, I'm getting a little bit dizzy after dancing like a metronome. Ooh, <laughs> that was really fun. Hey, it's really important to make sure you stay on beat and something like a metronome is super helpful to keep you on time. <laughs> Oh, and look at this, this is awesome. <laughs> I bet you might have seen one of these instruments before. Yeah, this is a keyboard or a piano. <laughs> yeah, and this keyboard is really awesome because it's an electric instrument. Yeah, this electric instrument means it needs electricity or batteries to make it work. Whoa. And look at how cool it is. It has all these keys, see? It has some white keys. Yeah, a lot of white keys you can press with your fingers and some black keys too. Yeah, in between the white keys. And you can press those too to make different notes. Hmm. Notes, what's a note? Hmm, let's turn on the keyboard and find out. <laughs> Did you hear that? Whoa, that makes such a pretty sound. If you press one of the keys, it makes a note. <laughs> if you press a different key somewhere else on the keyboard, it'll make a different note. Whoa, that note sounds different. It also makes me feel a little different too. <laughs> note sounds pretty happy. <laughs> this note sounds a little confused. Whoa! <laughs> and you can also play songs using lots of different notes. <laughs> the cool thing about a keyboard is it has so many sounds, you can make all kinds of songs. Like maybe you want a song to be a little spooky for Halloween. like a ghost is around. Whoa, <laughs> that was pretty fun though. And you can also play things that are maybe a little more classical or serious. Whoa. 
Ooh, it's making me thirsty for some very yummy tea and cookies. <laughs> you also can play other things instead of just using your fingers. Whoa, you can be really silly and use your whole hand. Like, if I change the sound and make a fist, I can roll my fist and play a song. <laughs> Whoa, that's a really funny song. <laughs> I'm gonna play it again. Oh, keyboards are so amazing. You can even make songs that sound magical. Music is so amazing! Hey, and when you use notes, it makes the song sound even better! <laughs> hey, earlier we made up a song about a tambourine, but we only had beats. Now that we have notes, let's sing a new song with some notes! Mm -hmm. Okay. Happy birthday to you! Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday from Flippy. Happy birthday to you. <laughs> Whoa, we did it. We sang a song using notes and made up a song using beats. <laughs> this was so much fun learning about musical instruments with you. Well, that's the end of this video. But if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Hey, will you spell my name with me? <laughs> okay, good. Here we go. P-L-I-P-P-I. -P -I. Blippi. <laughs> good job. Well, I'll see you real soon. I'm going to keep playing some sweet tunes. And hey, this one even plays itself. Bye-bye. It's me, Blippi. Whoa, and this is really fun rock climbing, but it's a little tricky. <laughs> hey, that was so much fun. Hey, let's do some awesome exercising. Let's do jumping jacks. Don't forget to stretch. Whoa, <laughs> exercising is so much fun. And always remember, after you exercise, to stay hydrated. <laughs> yeah. It's a water bottle. Whoa, this is really important to always have a water bottle after you exercise. <sighs> I'm feeling refreshed already. You know, it's also good to always eat fruits and vegetables and other healthy snacks after you exercise so you can keep your energy to keep on playing. Whoa, I think you and I should play some more. Look at these cool blocks. Whoa, there are so many colors. Red, green, blue, <laughs> yeah! Whoa, that was so much fun. Well, I think it's about time for you and I to eat some healthy snacks. And I know just the place that will have fun and exciting ways to eat fruits and vegetables. How about you and I make some tasty smoothies today? <laughs> yeah, would you like to come with me? Aw, thanks. <laughs> Let's go. I'll see you there. We're here today at Ross Smoothie Co. in Tampa, Florida. <laughs> yeah, come on. Hmm. I sure wish there was someone here to help us get a healthy snack. Welcome to Raw Smoothie Co. <laughs> hey, it's a person. I bet they can help us find a tasty treat. <laughs> Hello, my name's Blippi. My name is Gian. Nice to meet you. Oh, nice to meet you. Well, we've been looking for a really healthy snack. Think you can help us? I think I can. Oh, 
Well, we've been doing a lot of dancing and exercising. Hmm. What do you think would be the best healthy snack? Hmm. I would say a smoothie bowl. Whoa, a smoothie bowl? <laughs> yeah, that sounds delicious. Um, but what's a smoothie bowl? A smoothie bowl is an all organic combination of fruits, vegetables, nutrients, vitamins, and all things healthy. Whoa, that sounds perfect. And we like to try new things, especially if they're healthy. Hey, you know what healthy is, right? Healthy is something that's really good for your body and your muscles. <laughs> yeah, and helps you grow up big and strong. <laughs> yeah, let's try that smoothie bowl. You know what, Blippi? Come on back. Oh, let's go! <laughs> I'm so excited to make a smoothie bowl! Hey, Gian! Hey, Blippi! Well, what kind of smoothie bowl are we gonna make? We're gonna make an acai bowl today. An acai, acai. Close, it's acai. Whoa, acai. <laughs> That's pretty tricky. <laughs> Sounds really healthy and tasty, though. It is. It's absolutely amazing for you. Are you ready? Yeah! All right. Step one, we gotta put on gloves. Okay. We gotta make sure we put on the gloves. One glove. Two gloves. <laughs> Great. Next, we gotta break up our acai packet. That Whoa. should be good. <laughs> That's a really cool hammer. <laughs> now we gotta put it in our smoothie canister. Ooh. This will be so tasty when it's all blended up. <laughs> there you go. Oh, look, it's the color purple. Ooh. <laughs> okay, Gian, so what do we do next? Well, we gotta put more ingredients in there. Next is banana. Whoa, I love bananas. <laughs> this is gonna make it extra yummy. All right, we're gonna make it really tasty with some agave. Whoa, agave. Have you heard of agave before? Hmm, me neither. Well, what's that? All right, agave is a really healthy sweetener. It's not like sugar. It's much better for you to come from plants. Ooh, great. Okay, so we got bananas, and we got acai, and we got agave. What's next? Well, we gotta finish it off with some almond milk. Ooh, okay, I love almonds. <laughs> All right. <laughs> So where do we go next? Go over here to our ice machine. Grab a little bit of ice. Okay. And then we have to blend. Okay, let's go to the blender. You ready, Blippi? I'm all ready. This is gonna be so much fun blending it. And you know what the best thing to do while we pass the time and wait for it to finish getting blended? Dance party! Yeah! so cool! <laughs> yep. Let's keep going. Now we have to actually build the acai bowl. Whoa, and look at all these really tasty ingredients. There's all kinds of really cool things here. Yeah, we have the acai packet, and we have some spinach. Oh, <laughs> so yummy. And, yeah, do you know what this is? Mmm, crunchy granola. Whoa! And Gian, what are these white little flakes? Those are coconut flakes. Oh, coconuts? Ooh, I love coconuts. These will be really good too. And uh, this is, hmm, what about this? That's healthy chocolate. It's called cacao. Cacao? Whoa, we'll put some of that in too. And what about all these little seeds? Those little buddies are chia seeds and flax seeds. Whoa, I love seeds. <laughs> hey. I bet these seeds will be really tasty if you're a bird, but they're also really tasty if you want to stay nice and healthy. Oh, and then I know what these are. Look, a strawberry, mm. <laughs> and a banana. Whoa. We should definitely put these in. Okay. All right, are you ready to build a bowl? I'm all ready. <laughs> all right, we go back to our acai. Okay. First step, let's go ahead and put some granola in there. Next, I gotta grab my spatula over here, and we're gonna go ahead and put the acai in the bowl with the granola. Whoa, 
it was really hard and frozen, but once we blended it up, look, it looks like a smooth kind of paste. Oh, it almost looks like ice cream. <laughs> yeah, that's so tasty. <laughs> once we get our acai in the bowl, gonna flatten it out, smooth it out, make it look really nice. At Raw Smoothie Co, we're extra healthy, so we put greens in everything. Whoa, what kind of greens are those? Here we have organic spinach. Mmm, spinach, mmm. Spinach makes you really strong. <laughs> All right. Now, we're gonna put some coconut flakes on top. Whoa, coconut flakes. <laughs> Remember those from before? Yeah, really tasty stuff. Now, the best part. We gotta put our fruit on top. <laughs> yeah, I love fruit. So what fruits are we gonna put on it? I think we're gonna go with strawberry and banana today. Perfect, okay. All right, so get a scoop of our strawberry. We're gonna put that in here. Oh, that bowl not only looks healthy and delicious, but really, really colorful. <laughs> All right, next step is we gotta put our banana, and for that, we're gonna have to cut it. Okay. Make sure before you use ever a knife, you wanna make sure our grown-ups using the knife or you ask permission. Mm -hmm. I'm a professional blippy, so I think I got this. Oh, look at it. He peeled off the banana, and now he's cutting it up into slices. Whoa, and it'll fit perfectly in the acai bowl. I'm gonna chop it up nice and small. Now we're gonna put it in our acai bowl. Let's get our acai bowl close. Next step, we gotta put our healthy chocolate, cacao. Whoa, look at all that chocolate. <laughs> can I put a little extra chocolate on? You absolutely can. Here, you can go ahead and do the next scoop. Okay, here we go. Let's scoop up some chocolate. Whoa, it's raining chocolate. Yummy. <laughs> oh, that was really good. Last step, Blippi, and then you can almost eat it. Is seeds, you know Whoa, it. Look at all the seeds. Whoa, there's so many seeds. Here we go. It's gonna rain seeds. Whoa, that was so much fun. <laughs> is that it? This is it, Blippi. There you go. Whoa, look at this. It's so delicious and colorful. We have the granola and our blended acai. Oh, our delicious toppings. <laughs> yeah. I'm so excited to eat this delicious smoothie bowl. Hey, Gian, this is a smoothie bowl because we use a spoon to eat it and it's in a bowl, but what if I wanted to put this in a cup and drink it through a straw? Well, we can make a smoothie. Oh, a smoothie? I would love to eat a smoothie. <laughs> yeah. Ooh, mm, this looks really tasty. But All right. Think you could teach us how to make a smoothie? Yeah, and actually at Raw Smoothie Co, we'll make a green smoothie, so it's extra healthy. Whoa! I can't wait to make a green smoothie. But first, I want a little bite. So, what's the first step to make a healthy smoothie? First, let's grab our smoothie canister. And so, what are we gonna put inside? Well, let's start with the easiest ingredients to blend. Okay. So, let's start off with our juice. I love juice, especially fruit juice. <laughs> Next, we're gonna put healthy greens in our smoothie. Ooh, I love spinach and healthy greens. Okay. Okay, so what next? I'm gonna let you take care of the next part. Okay, I think we'll, I know what we're gonna do next. We'll put in some fruit. That's right. So go ahead and put in some banana. Okay, here we go. Got some banana. And hmm, put some of this fruit in. Do you know what fruit this is? Yeah, this is a tasty mango. Okay, here we go. And this is one of my favorites. The last fruit we need is some pineapple. <laughs> yeah. Let's put some seeds and then ice it. So just put some seeds in there? Yeah, why don't you throw some seeds in there, Bobby? Okay. Rain and seeds. Okay, let's go on to the next step. All right, let's put some ice in there. Okay, here we go. Here we go. And into the blender. Perfect. <laughs> okay, so now 
Now what are we doing? Now we have to blend it. Okay, here you go. Thank you. Are you ready to try your smoothie blipping? I am so ready and excited. <laughs> Let's try it. Here we go. This looks so tasty. Yeah. Well, it's kind of like the smoothie bowl, but wait, that in a bowl with a spoon. But this one, <laughs> this smoothie. Ooh, thanks, Gian. Has a straw. Okay, put that in there. Hmm. We'll get the little paper off. Oh, can you help me, Gian? Absolutely. Ooh, I am so excited to taste this smoothie. Okay, here we go. Oh, yeah! This smoothie is so tasty! And it's really healthy, too. I'm gonna have another sip. I'll see you soon. Hey! Whoa, that was so much fun learning how to make smoothies at Raw Smoothie Co. <laughs> yeah! They are so tasty <sighs> and healthy because they're organic. Ooh. <laughs> hey, what's that over there? Ooh, look at it. It says chef's table. Ooh. <laughs> I bet we're gonna eat some yummy foods. <laughs> Whoa, and look at that. It's a picture of a tongue. Bah, bah. <laughs> so silly. Why would there be a picture of a tongue? Hmm. Oh, because our tongue uh, helps us to taste. <laughs> it helps us to taste because our tongue has taste buds. Yeah, and that tells our brain if something is sweet <laughs> or sour. <laughs> Whoa, taste test. I bet we're gonna taste all kinds of new foods. <laughs> I'm so excited. Let's go see what we're gonna try. Come on. Whoa, look, we're here at the chef's table. Ooh, and look at all these little containers. Yeah, I bet there's food for us to taste in each one of them. <laughs> Let's start right here. Ooh, look at it. It's a grapefruit. Mm. <laughs> I bet this grapefruit is really tasty. Okay, let's try it. Ooh, that grapefruit tastes really good. Hmm, it tastes kinda bitter. Yeah, not really super sweet, but it doesn't taste bad. It just tastes kinda bitter. Ooh, <laughs> so yummy. Okay, gotta figure out what's in this next container. Let's see. Oh, <laughs> look at it. Yeah, I bet you know what food this is. It's a yummy pretzel. Mm. <laughs> Let's take a bite. This pretzel is really tasty. Yeah, it's really salty. You see, it's so rough and bumpy because of all the little, little crystals of salt. <laughs> yeah, and that salt tastes really good on my taste buds. Mm. <laughs> bye bye, pretzel. <laughs> mm. Whoa, <laughs> look at it. This is a little triangle. <laughs> yeah, it's a triangle because it has one, two, three sides. Yeah, look at it. <laughs> this triangle is from a watermelon. I can't wait to taste this one. Mmm, this watermelon is really sweet. I love foods that are sweet because they make me so happy. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna have some more sweet watermelon later. Ooh. Okay, we're almost to the end. I'm so excited for this next food. Ooh, this one's a really small one. This is a lime. It's the color green. Let's give it a try. Mmm. Ooh. <laughs> Whoa. This has a really, really, really cool flavor. It's sour. This lime is so sour, 
Ooh, it makes my face and body do all kinds of silly shapes. Ooh. <laughs> I'm gonna taste it one more time. Woo! <laughs> I really like that sour lime. Ooh, I feel so awake. Whoa! <laughs> okay, we're on the last food. Let's see what's inside. Whoa! It's a pepper. Ooh. And it's green. There's an orange pepper and a red pepper. I think I'm gonna try the orange pepper because it's my favorite color. Okay, here we go. We'll just take a teeny bite. <laughs> Ooh, that pepper is really spicy. Woo, there's like a dance party in my mouth. Woo. <sighs> It's so spicy. I think I need to eat some water. Is there any wa water? We gotta find some water. Ooh. We got the water. Oh, better. I like spicy food, but sometimes you need a little water after you eat it because it makes your mouth ooh, so energized. Ooh. Well, this was so much fun. I hope we can taste some more foods together soon. <laughs> Whoa, I had such a fun day with you today. We learned about so many different things, like moving your body is healthy exercise. And it's important to fill your body with really healthy foods and snacks. Mm. <laughs> it's also really fun that we learned how to make smoothies and we taste with our tongue. <laughs> So silly. Well, this is the end of this video. But if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Hey, will you spell my name with me? <laughs> yeah. B-L-I-P-P-I. -P -P -I. Good job. Well, I'll see you real soon. Bye-bye. <laughs> Ooh, I almost forgot. Always keep yourself hydrated. <sighs> Come on everyone, let's make learning fun So much to learn about, it'll make you wanna shout with me